Blackpink's. Lisa came to South Korea back in 2010 and made her debut with Blackpink in 2016. As she has been living in Korea for a long time, she has often shown her affection for Korea by referring to South Korea as our country. In an episode of an entertainment program that aired back in 2017, Lisa and Jisoo appeared as special guests. On this day, Jisoo shared that Lisa would get mad at the members say that she is a foreigner. Jisoo shared on the show that there was a time when she said to Lisa, you're a foreigner though, and Lisa said to her, that phrase makes her mad. Jisoo then reminded Lisa, Lisa you're from another country so you are a foreigner, to which Lisa replied, oh that's right, I forgot. In addition, there are often times in which Lisa would refer to Korea as our country during various V Live broadcasts. In one V Live, Jisoo asked Lisa, what is South Korea? In which Lisa replied, our country. Jisoo continued to ask, then what about Thailand? And Lisa replied, my country, making the members laugh. Korean netizens praised Lisa for her love towards Korea and stated that she is the only non-Korean idol member with perfect pronunciation and excellent vocabulary when speaking Korean. Netizens expressed their love and support for Lisa by commenting, I think Lisa has a more accurate pronunciation than I do. I found out about Thailand more because of Lisa, I love her, and she should be made an honorary Korean. In an interview with IWM Buzz, Rosé revealed why she's close with Jenny, Lisa, and Jisoo. The K-pop star from New Zealand joined YG Entertainment in 2012. Jenny helped her learn the cultural habits of Koreans. When she first joined YG Entertainment, Rosé always thought of Jisoo as an amazing trainee with perfect fashion style. She considered Jisoo as her role model. Rosé also said that Lisa was one of the first Blackpink members she met. She said that Lisa often expressed her displeasure at being away from home. Since they are both far from home, Rosé feels a close relationship to Lisa.